The following is a World of Crap special presentation. Coming to you from New Palace Lanes in Fitchburg, Massachusetts, it's time for a special edition of Watch Me Suck at Bowling! Hello and welcome to another special edition of Watch Me Suck at Bowling Triple Challenge where I go up against someone who's just a hair better than I am. Maybe just a hair. <laughs> For those of you that are in candle pins, this guy doesn't need too much of an introduction. For the other 95% that watch this, this is Dennis Nuzzo, one of the hosts of King of the Palace. Hello. And, well, you know the drill, three games. Yeah. And you see how close I can come to beating the challenger. And speaking of the challenger, this won't make sense till you see it in post-production, but when I snap my fingers, nothing will appear right now. Again, post-production, there'll be a scorecard appearing. That's our base. All right. So, so what is your average? Uh, I'm having a bad year due to an injury. Right now, it's uh, 108. All right. Your high single? 187. That's pretty good. A little bit. Yeah. And the high triple? 484. Pretty good. And now the numbers, he's, he's shaking right now. And I will have to tell you that I get my averages by looking at the last 20 games I bowled against somebody. And I will tell you, it's probably going to drop like the elevator in the Twilight Zone Tower of Terror today. Good ride. Anyway. So far, my overinflated average, 91. That's not bad. High, high single, 139. And the high triple, 314. And those are the highs and lows. Or should I say, actually, that's just our averages and stuff. That's usually how I do the football tree circuit bowling. Okay, three games. Am I going to win it? Or is he going to win it? There's no way in telling until the show is over. <coughs> me, me. <coughs> Let's get it on. Game one, frame one, ball one. It's time for me to show Dennis who is the winner. Ball two, ball one, 10 pin thing. Got it right out of the way. Ball three. For those of you who like the pin setters, here's the bowl more in action. And there you go. Frame two, ball one. Like most competitions, we are going to alternate every other frame. Ball two, you know the rule, watch me suck. Minor lobs, yeah. I suck. Ball three. And speaking of three, that's all I got. Frame one, ball one. See, now that's what a fast throw looks like. Oh, I hit the head pin, that's one. Ball two, whenever he's ready. Yep. I missed that. 
first ball and a bonus of seven. Two in a row. So far, this is a very close match. There's, it's too close to call. Me, first frame nine, second one, a nice three for a 12. So far, Dennis Fair, and then a second spare, first ball seven. So he has at least a 27. Can I catch up? Frame three, ball one. I probably should have said it. <laughs> Ball two, the Palace Gods hate me. Ball three. Seven. Frame four, ball one, long technical yeah, difficulty, ball. which means I gotta sync the cameras up twice. Ball two. Covered with an eight. I can see how the Putnam Street thing's gonna go next week. Four ball one and top six. Right at the needle. Welcome to Masons. Starts frame number four with a right bucket and a seven pin. Just missed. A little left. And any. Yep, this is a close one. You can see I'm in really, uh, Prime form, seven, and then an eight at 27 versus Dennis. He's slipping. He's got a 10 and an eight. He's only a 51. I'm, catch, I'm gonna catch up pretty fast. Frame five, ball one. Ball two. Ball three, I swear, every time I do one of these, I do much worse than I normally do. Eight. Frame six, ball one. Ball two. Finally a good ball. That happened. Ball three. Nainer. 
see if you can throw a ball really fast, you can throw one really off to the side and still get something good out of it. Spare! Seven, eight fill. Looks like we got an eight fill. Spears it up again. This one's really, really razor, sh razor sharp. Who knows who's gonna win this one? Me, I got an eight and then a nine. We're a 44. Dennis, two spares. First one. The first ball giving eight for his fill. 79 with a bonus. Frame seven, ball one. Ball two. Three. Honestly, I am trying. Looks like an eight. Frame eight, ball one. Ball two going for the Emily. That's nothing in ball one, everything on two. Ball three. So, of course, it's Almost a backdoor strike. Anytime you miss a single pin first bear, the next ball, you always throw an 8, 9, or a 10. That's why it's what we call it the always ball. Alright, let's face it. Even for me, this is not very good. 8 and a 6 with a 58. And Dennis with a 9, and then a strike. So far, he's got a 107 and two bonus balls. Frame 9, ball 1. If I use common core math, I can still win this game. My duck. Ball two. Ball three. Well, like I said, the Palace Gods hate me. Not to take eight. Let's get it over with. shot it, which is why it didn't become a spare. And nine. Alrighty. Ooh. Well, I don't know if that was good. Too many 
He's ready. Fill's not too bad, but the lead. I'm underperforming, even though eight and a nine with a 75. You got two spares. And 10 fill on the strike for the first spare. Then the second spare was knocked down six to fill that in. Then his bonus ball at the end of the game was a seven. 150. Who knows who's going to win the whole thing? There's two more games to go. Game two, frame one, ball one. Yeah, it wasn't one of my best, but I think I think Dennis is a little nervous. He's gotta he's gotta amp it up a little bit. Ball two, it's no secret. Somehow in this place I just can't do well. Ball three, like I said, my average is gonna plummet today. I had to go for it and it didn't quite work. Eight's not a bad start for me. Frame two, ball one. Ball two. Ball three. I realize I could stand anywhere right two thirds of the lane and not block pin cam, yet I'm ducking. This first oh, well, ball of the second game as I'm trying to say something. Wow, what a mess. Is a 10 pin Greek church. And he's got an Starting to put a little more heat in the action. A pair of eights for a 16. Dennis got a spare. And then an eight in the second frame. The first five being the fill. 23. Frame three, ball one. Hey, finally. Finally, El Strico. Frame four by one. Two well stink of the bonus balls. What will they add up to? We know the drill. The only places I've got doubles, Putnam Street Lanes, because it's Putnam's. Acton Bowl Drum, because it's a grease pit. 
Ryan's pull away in Gardner, which is strange because that's a hard place. And for those of you who've never bowled there but bowled at Riverwalk, you get the idea of what Brian's is like. Could the palace, the place where the gods hate my guts, give it to me? So far, El Stinko 1 lived up to its name of the one. Box 2, El Stinko 2. Fill on a strike, but seven's all right. Ball three. Not exactly where I was going, but hey, I'll take it. Ten. Frame three. Little too full. Just didn't happen. Ow. Niner. Three, four. Another full shot. Oh, two. And, oh, yeah, there it went. That's too slow and far behind. Ten. Do not adjust your computer. Do not reboot. Your computer's not experiencing a blue screen of death. I'm actually winning this one. Strike. And then a ten. The first seven of the two balls, making the fill. Three. Dennis, a nine and a ten, 42. Check the thermostat in hell. But we know what's not gonna last. Frame five, ball one. I'm gaining. The force. Ball two. Ball three. Ten. Three, six, ball one. All right, one more ball, Ryan. Like I could go in there. Ball two. What a crappy shot, but look what I got. Ball three. Back to normal. Alright, I knocked something down and see, that's an eight. There's a half post. Once again, 
I'm going to ensure you, your computer's not going to blue screen of death on you when you see in the store here. A 10 and an 8 at a 61. Dennis and 8 and a 7, 57. Frame 7, ball 1. The pin cam is now back in position. Ball 2. Take dumb luck spears anytime. Frame eight ball one. El Stinko the bonus ball. What will the bonus be? Halfway decent six fill, but bucket right or left. Left. Two. He owes me royalties on that shot. Two. Nice attempt. Three. And eight. Frame it on. No. Once again, I am showing you you're not seeing things. Got a spare and seven and then a nine and eight. Six of those being the fill, 86. And Dennis, he's warmed up again. He's got a spare in the last frame and eight in seven. So far he's got a 75. Frame nine ball one. to makeable spare. Watch me blow it. I guess I didn't blow it. Last frame ball one. El Stinko, the bonus ball. What would this bonus be? We got a new palace right with a nine. Ball two, new palace right. That's what I call it. Oh, that's a nine. All right, Dennis is filling his bonus. The bonus. And El Stinko leaves him a bad leave, but a six filling to him. Crap, I won against a pro. And hey, the pressure's off now. Pressure is off. 
Game number two, you are not seeing things. The higher number is undermining. But the pressure is off now. He's had his awful game. Pair of nines for 96. And me, I got a spare with a nine fill. And unfortunately, that ball went in the gutter. Took out the new palace right and left the nine. 114. So another thing you can look forward to is this is practically as good as I get here. Game number three. Have I warmed up finally? Game three, frame one, ball one. I usually joke about this, but I am gonna say, and it, it's really happening, I'm closing the gap. Too bad. And that is what it shall be. Frame two, ball one. Now let's put this in perspective. 114 is about as good as I get. Just flew to the back. Ball three. Ten. Frame two, ball one. Ooh, favorable. Spare. I swore that would be. After two, he's starting to gain it back. A nine and one, eight and two for 17. Dennis, he's got the perfect game going with a pair of tens and a 20. And in candle pins, a perfect game is getting all the pins knocked down in every turn. So minimum perfect score is 100. The unattainable 300 is the max. Let's get it going. Frame three ball one. Ball two. It's a favorable piece of wood right there. Let's see if we can do this. Ball three. Yeah, helpful pieces of wood. Who need them? Purposely went for the points. The last one was an extra. That's a nine. Frame four, ball one. Ball two. I'm being punished for the second game. I knew the second game's a fluke, okay? Bowling gods. And we left the bowling gods' middle finger for nine. Frame three, ball one. Ooh, nice shot, but what does he get for it? 
five and seven. Ball two. Very difficult to skin a pin to get it to hit the other one. Frame four ball one. Nice. Oh, come on. Oh. Ball two. There we go. Spare. I got one. After four. A pair of nines. We're a 35, so doing all right. And then Dennis, he got an eight. And then a spare. And so far, he's got a 38 with a bonus set. We make a frame for ball one. Then we had people at home. Ball two. Bowling gods showing their middle finger again. If that were a strike, I wouldn't have deserved it. But we got made a good shot, but of course I. Spare's pretty good. Frame six ball one. Al Stinko, the bonus ball. What will the bonus be? Queens leave, seven fill. Ball two. Ball three. Kind of hucked that one away for eight. Bonus is a nine. It's another one. Next frame. First ball off to the side. A uh, slight help in the back, but probably not that good. Keep doing it Ball two. I believe that was a four fill. And a ten. That was sort of what was stuck in the Frame seven, ball one. Let's see if I can win this whole thing. How did that almost happen? Ball two, spread eagle with a clipped wing. Where is it? There it is. For me, that wasn't a bad shot. Take eight. Frame eight, ball one. Eight is enough. Frame seven, ball one. Ooh. 
Now he leaves a new palace right. Well, too. Say goodbye to the new palace right. Still. Free me up one. Oh, nice headshot, and then that. One of my least favorite spare leaders. Two frames, let's see if I can put Dennis away. Ball two. Balls like that, not happening. Ball three. Hey, we're still missing eight. We'll leave the bowling god's middle finger again for nine. Last frame, last game for me, ball one. Yeah, my average plummeted, but only because of game one. Two, just that many away from the middle of average. So I went on that and everything related to any other. Yeah, I saw that. Except for the style What a way to go. Five to end. And oh, close, but not quite. In any bowling, that's called a washout. Ball two. And there you go. Backdoor action. The bonus is six, seven, and a seven. Well, it looks like I didn't put Dennis away in the final game. Came very, very close there with a 9 and a 5 for a 90, right in the middle of average ability for a schmuck like myself. He got a 10, then a spare, 7 for the final bonus of a 125. As for the triple, I got a 279. And Dennis got a 371. That means, uh, let's see. I gotta do math, and that'll appear in the video because I suck at math as well as bowling. Typically there's a victory speech, but he didn't want to do that. So this was taped before the next edition of King of the Palace. And of course you know, when we talk about King of the Palace, Watch Me Suck at Bowling is proud to sponsor Hit Canapa TV show King of the Palace where you can watch people like Dennis that are actually good at this game. Even if he blows one once in a while. Search for King of the Palace on YouTube, search Party Hearts Content, and watch them. Like what you see, go to youtube.com slash new palace links, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell. See new videos as they come along.
that will be it for this edition of Watch Me Suck at Bowling Triple Challenge. Georgia 551 versus Dennis Nuzzo. A miracle in game two. This is Georgia 551 saying, hope you enjoyed and have a good one. The following is a special World of Crap presentation.